Hello, I'm Dane Anthony. A nearly nine acre, truly authentic Victorian manor with 14 buildings and thousands of visitors each year. The Emlyn Physic Estate is just too much for one segment. The billiard room. Where's the wet bar? Uh, that evidently has been gone. I don't know where <laughs> it is. Billiards was very important to Victorian gentlemen. Uh, on the weekends, the men would go up and play billiards. They would probably smoke their cigars and their pipes and they would drink their, their scotch and their bourbon and their rye and they would have a grand old time. And billiards don't have pockets. That's correct. Right. But there was one thing that the billiards room did not allow, and that was ladies. It was a men's room only. Now, the estate originally had 14 acres of land, and the majority of the property ran behind the estate. Where the estate ended was a little bit of marshland, and then was the ocean. Now there's nine blocks of houses between here and the ocean. Well, the music rooms are very important. This was their primary method of entertainment. They didn't have radios or TVs. So everyone learned to play a musical instrument. Children primarily learned some of them as young as toddlers. That's how important it was. Now this piano is not the original uh, of the house. The original is long since gone. Our curators searched for a lot of years to find this piano. Uh, it is a Victorian piece. We have the original Bill of Sale. This is called a square piano and it was made in 1868, which makes it at about the height of American Victoriana. It's still playable, I understand. Yes, that's correct. There's more to see of the Emlyn Physic Estate. Y'all come back now.